This week, Grammy-winning artist and real estate investor, Moby takes the real deal on an exclusive tour of his two unique investment properties. First to the Upper West Side, where Moby shows us the dome apartment atop the El Dorado. And then down to Gramercy to get a pre-construction peek at Landmark 17's Eric Clapton Chapel apartment. Now, let's get inside the real deal. Exchange at 25 Broad, sponsor of this webcast, invites you to visit our remastered model residences. 120 Worcester Street is a gorgeous six-story loft building boasting prime retail space in the heart of Soho. 120 Worcester takes full advantage of its brilliant location with four fetching storefronts. Just 25 feet from heavily trafficked Prince Street. Hershey is sweet in all seasons. Visit during Hershey Park in the Dark for our spooktacular roller coasters. And Treatville, our hometown village of sweets and treats. Then enjoy millions of twinkling lights with Hershey Park Christmas Candy Lane and Hershey Sweet Lights. Christopher is a 15-year-old male who has been a patient in the office since early childhood. He made an appointment today because of a chronic stomach ache. He has no fever or other symptoms. This episode is brought to you by Trump Mortgage. Set upon 65 acres in Claverick, New York, Claverick Homesteads offers a choice of seven turnkey homesteads. On parcels ranging from five to 21 acres, create a customized homestead by adding one to two accessory buildings. Now experience New York's premier real estate magazine in person. One night only, Tuesday, March 20th at Lincoln Center's Avery Fisher Hall. The biggest names in the real estate business. 2,700 attendees. Your ticket inside New York's real estate market. Niantic Bay, with its marinas and yacht clubs, is especially appealing to beachgoers and boating enthusiasts. The newly built boardwalk is a beautiful spot for a walk or run along the water. The East Lime School System, featuring a brand new middle school, is among Connecticut and the nation's finest, with above average median SAT scores. Because we heard that the neighborhood on Fifth Avenue was one of the attractions of the hotel, we decided to go check it out. And what we found was a fairly well-developed commercial and residential area, a stone's throw away from Prospect Park, with many shops, restaurants, and a nice neighborhood ambience.